This video is about gelatinization. Gelatinization is a process that causes a sauce to thicken. A sauce thickens due to the starch contained in flour. Flour is commonly added to sauces, including a roux sauce and bechamel sauce. When flour is added to liquid and heated to around 60 degrees Celsius, the starch granules begin to swell as they absorb liquid. When the sauce reaches a temperature of around 80 to 85 degrees Celsius, the starch granules will have absorbed a large amount of water. As they move around in the hot water of a saucepan, they bump into each other, eventually bursting and releasing the starch from the granules into the liquid. The starch released into the liquid causes it to thicken. At around 100 degrees Celsius, gelatinization is complete, so the sauce will not continue to thicken. The thickness, the viscosity, depends on the ratio of flour to liquid. If more flour is used, therefore containing more starch, the liquid will be thicker. The mixture thickens while cooling and forms a gel. Dishes that include the process of gelatinization include a roux sauce, velouté sauce, custard, lemon meringue pie and cheese sauce. Different factors affect gelatinization. The amount of water, a small amount results in a thick sauce, a large amount of water results in a runny sauce. The type of starch that is used. Corn flour is 100% starch, but normal plain flour is 75% starch. Temperature, the starch begins to thicken at 60 degrees Celsius and is not complete until 100 degrees Celsius, which is boiling point. Stirring is very important. This is often an exam question. If you don't stir it properly, the flour will not be distributed around the pan and also may sink to the bottom. This will result in a lumpy sauce. Sugar. Now, if you use too much sugar, it can stop the gel from forming as the sugar competes with the starch for water. And finally, if you use something acidic, it breaks the gel, so it should be added after the sauce has thickened. Here is an exam question regarding gelatinization. It's from the 2022 exam paper. Explain the stages of gelatinization with making a starch based custard. Include key temperatures in your answer. So here is the marking criteria given to teachers to mark the work. So these would all give you a mark. So for instance, custard is made using custard powder or corn flour, which contains starch. The custard powder stroke corn flour would be combined with milk before being heated. The mixture would need to be stirred continuously to form a suspension, so the starch granules spread through the liquid. Stirring the sauce prevents starch sticking to the bottom of the saucepan, causing lumps to form. When heated, the starch granules begin to absorb the milk. At 60 degrees Celsius, starch granules begin to soften and swell. At 80 degrees Celsius, the starch granules will burst, releasing the starch into the liquid. The starch thickens the mixture. At 100 degrees Celsius, gelatinization or the thickening is complete. As the custard cools down, a skin can develop and become a solid gel.